Hello! So Hi. I'm here today with Mel from Mel Bright. Hi. <laughs> I told you I was going to do a collab with her, finally got to it. And um, yeah, today we're going to make bentos because we're cool like that. Yeah, we so. are. And it's kawaii. To to demo kawaii desu ne. Yeah? Yes. <laughs> we're also going to be speaking in really bad Japanese the whole time, Hi. so just go with it. What I thought we would make today was chicken karaage, mm -hmm. uh, onigiri, usagi ringo, yeah. and the carrots. Uh, carrot canipra, uh -huh. so just a couple of fillers along with rice. Mm -hmm. But uh, as anyone will tell you, the first step to making a really good bento is to have really good rice. So yeah. we should go ahead and make that. Just like teaspoons and cups and that kind of stuff. We just mm. kilogram. You know the metric system. The one that makes sense. Yeah. I yeah. Know. <laughs> to give the rice a little bit of extra flavoring, you put a splash of median in with the water. What is? Median is a alcohol plus sugar sort of mixture. Uh -huh. It's not very high in alcohol content, I would say like 5%, oh. but it's just like cooking with sherry. We turn that on and we let it boil, mm -hmm. and yeah, we let that cook. Alright, so here's the deal. When I was at the Asian market yesterday, I found a whole lot of cheap, random Japanese goodies, and uh, they're all really strange. And hopefully really good, but we're gonna try a couple of them as we cook. Hopefully. So we're gonna try. Yeah. So the first one we have are lychee jellies, and I don't know. I like lychees, so I'm like hopeful them. about this. Oh, it tears at the side. Oh. No. <laughs> How do you think we should eat this? Just like jump yeah. into it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. Ready? Three, yeah. two, one. Mmm. Mm. <laughs> it's juicy, and it tastes like. Liches, but but like with a whole lot of jelly. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna eat the whole thing, I guess. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so the next thing we should probably do is go ahead and get our chicken marinating. So, here you go. So now we wait a little bit. Uh-huh. Yeah. Should we try something else, you think? Hmm. Yeah. It's ground up rice and with extra stuff inside of it. Huh. We chose a thing, put it in your mouth. <laughs> what is this? Here you go. Three, two, one. What is this? <laughs> Not really. What are you? I can read Japanese. <laughs> I just rolled it up and put it off. But so it was from a real chicken. It's from a real chicken. Real Whoa. eggs from real chicken. Step one. So go ahead and crack it in. Do do do. Yay! Thank you. Yeah. Oh, not whole. Please. In a minute. We still need to make the onigiri and the, the onigiri fried. will do last. The carrots we should probably uh -huh. do next, and the usagi dingo we can do after that yeah. while our oil is heating up for the frying. You want about half an inch rounds. So oh, about half this. an inch. Okay. Yeah. Now makes sense. Stop using inches. Sorry. Convert yourself to the metrical system. I can't, I, I can't think in centimeters and millimeters. These little cutters, mm -hmm. and they are different flower shapes, so pick your flower shape that you would like. And I think I like this one. And then we get to cut little shapes out of the carrots. We're gonna try our third little snack, which is seaweed, straight up. Thank you. You're welcome. We're gonna be so full by the time we get to our bentos that we're not gonna need to eat our bentos. No way. <laughs> never. Okay, never. <laughs> I'm never gonna be full. It's so thin. Look at it, it's so thin. Three, two, one. Oh, mm. oh. But not on a regular basis. Mm. But they're pretty delicious. So I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It doesn't break like a crisp. Yeah. And it sticks in your paw. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's just the weird things like that. Mm. But I also like how you can eat them like a rabbit. Like just <laughs> Maybe that's just me. 
Yeah. Alright, so we're just gonna let our chicken fry off and then we're gonna make some uh, usagi dingo and then make our onigiri and I'll be back for that, alright? Cool, bye! This has had enough time to cool down. So what we're gonna do is form them into little triangles with our mm -hmm. hands, then wrap them, or dip them in furikake, mm -hmm. and then wrap them in a sheet of nori, which looks like this, and I will cut up into little mm -hmm. strips. The easiest way to do it is to wet your hands a little bit before you touch the rice. Yeah. Do it like this. Just scoop out a handful of rice, like about this. Oh, I'll get a little bit on the bottom. That's fine. And then just form it in triangles like this. Okay, that's going to be the... No. Put it together. And then just squeeze and turn. Um, Close. Okay, I just give up. <laughs> if you want to try again, it's fine. It's horrible. <laughs> I just you'll, know it. you'll get the hang of it. It's fine. Yeah, beautiful. And here's the complete product. Sweep. <laughs> Yay! So, how do you feel after making your first bento? Oh, uh, really good. I really like it. It was super interesting and. Oh. Just one to eat and all. <laughs> so, I think that's what we're gonna go do real quick is yeah. eat it. So, talk to you later. Bye. Best wishes.